We first told you about this story back in June. Now we're, we are finally getting to see this fight for ourselves. As for who is at fault, you'll have to be the judge. Fists flying in the hallways of Memorial West Hospital between a dying patient's caregiver and his doctor. It happened back in June when Matthew Copeland was acting as a health surrogate for a friend. He had uh, terminal cancer and his kidneys had stopped functioning. At the hospital, Dr. William Sanchez was assigned to provide his care. A few days later, though, Copeland and another health surrogate grew concerned over medication the doctor had prescribed. But when questioned, Copeland says Sanchez wasn't having it. And he walked to the door and he turned around and he said, F you to me. And then he walked out of the door throwing his hands up in the air. You can see Sanchez walk out looking exasperated as Copeland follows him, telling us he was demanding to speak to a supervisor. That's when Sanchez turns, wagging his finger in Copeland's face before grabbing him by the shirt, shaking him and shoving him backward. Copeland then swipes at Sanchez but misses and things turn violent. He comes and he punches me in the in the side of the head um, and, and he puts his hands around my throat. With Copeland then swings his hat at Sanchez and Sanchez retaliates with more punches before the two are separated. Months later, Sanchez is back practicing and Copeland is not happy about it. I don't believe this man should be practicing medicine. I think his license should be taken from him. So I reached out to Dr. Sanchez and his attorney, and they sent me this statement that says, in part, the state attorney's office chose not to press charges because Dr. Sanchez was, with, was within his rights to defend himself. They also called Copeland's actions, quote, intolerable conduct and say Dr. Sanchez is back to giving care to others. Now, Memorial tells me that he is not employed by them. They say he is affiliated with Memorial and he has the right to practice there, privileges to practice there. As for Copeland, he and his attorney say they are going to be going forward with civil charges against Dr. Sanchez.